Whoa! Guys, that was amazing. But what's more amazing, guys, is that we finally hit 250,000 subscribers. Now, I have a new challenge for you. Our brand new goal is 500,000 subscribers. So before this video gets started, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and don't forget to click that post notification bell for more videos and live streams. Now I gotta go guys, I'm late for my race, I'll see you in the video! What is going on guys, it is your boy T Stingray and welcome back to another video. Today guys, we are here in CDT because we're going to be reviewing the very first vehicle that we just unlocked on this season guys. Yes, season 14 is out now guys and you can see we've already unlocked the Nissan 350S Pro and today we're going to see if this is actually worth it guys. But before we get started, be sure to smash that thumbs up button, subscribe if you guys have it and don't forget to click that post notification bell. Now, let's get started with this video. Alright, the Nissan. Nissan 360 Pro guys so you can see we got a bunch of Nissan in here now the only thing that got me was the pro part guys and I know this is like a JDM type of update but it seems like they went back to the drifting so let's go ahead and pull that out oh here we go the, the 350s pro now i don't think we have the new spoiler for it yet let's go ahead and look for it let's see if we're able to put it is this is oh this is the s014 but where's our season 14 one i don't see it here anywhere let's go ahead and lower this i think we did mod this already but not fully yet guys and let's see if we have our season uh 14 rims here yes we do look at that that's actually pretty sick let's go ahead and pop out our car right now yo look at this so you guys can see it's almost the same as the other cars but this one is a right-handed drive you guys can see it goes up to 150 miles an hour with a 6.9 handling now the handling is like that guys because it is a drift car it's not supposed to be for the brand new race or season uh you know circuit races guys but We'll give it a try. Let's give it a shot right now. Here we go. Season 14 starting. Let me know in the comments down below, guys. Do you enjoy this brand new update? Yes or no? Oh my gosh. We got other cars in here. I am definitely going to lose. Look at all these other cars that everyone else is using. They are not using the pro cars at all. <laughs> here we go, boys. This is it. The cherry blossom race is what I like to call it. Look at this. Everybody's just taking off. This is not fair. Oh, everybody's just crashing right there. Let's drift. Oh, look at this. Yo, okay, the drift is a little bit delayed this season. I feel like they changed the uh, the handling of the cars. But even if we don't try to drift, guys, we can only go up to like 150 miles an hour. Here's the little spinneroos right here or the uh, obstacles you have to avoid. Let's go this way. Let's see if we can try to drift through this whole entire park. Oh, here we go. And there's a drift track right there. My boy in the F1 just gave up. I feel like we're going to get lapped trying to, uh, <laughs> trying to actually do this. Maybe we'll take it to the drift track and see if it's actually good. All right, let's make, make this one not a drift lap. Let's see how much we catch up. Can we do a fast drift? Yes, we can. Yeah, boy, look at that. I think I just got lapped by those other guys right there. Okay, this has to be the, <laughs> the slowest race ever for these cars. I don't know why they picked these cars for this race. It, it should have corresponded. But maybe the more we play this, maybe we can unlock cooler cars. I don't know. I, may, I am excited to unlock the S1000 though. That one I'm excited for. In the comments down below, how many days or hours did it take you guys to complete this update? Let me know right now. Dude, the drift track is literally calling my name, bro. I'm literally about to get lapped two times in this race. Here we go. Let's go ahead and pass this. This is my last lap, I believe, because everyone has already passed me. Maybe we need to do a full server race with this car or we need to do a full server race with these type of cars i think that would be pretty fun and a little hectic and maybe we can even do it with only f1 cars guys Ooh, that's a good idea look at this four laps only and i got lap there we go we still got 55 trophies bro that's not bad all right let's get these right here yeah look how many how much oh we just got oh we got the s14 spoiler i thought we unlocked it but we didn't let's go ahead and get this yeah look at that that is a sick spoiler we're gonna put that on right now we got 25k and 50k in cash right there not too bad complete 800 oh eight laps around the season race and i get 200 trophies just for that Dude, this season is actually pretty easy i'm not gonna lie all right next let's go to the drift trial and this one is gonna be a little bit different because we're gonna upgrade our car fully let's go ahead and get the race engine for 157k 94k for the race turbo race tires 16k race brakes race upgrades and last but not least i think we're gonna leave it at real wheel drive here's our new stats 196 at 6.9 handling guys 
Dude, they, they don't even go 200 miles an hour, but it's okay. It's a 350Z. Let's see how many points this gets us. Ooh, it does drift a little bit different. It feels like I'm drifting a Nissan GTR for some reason. Like, it's a little bit slower. Oh my gosh, okay. Maybe not a good drift car either. I don't know, guys. What do you think? Is that a car part? That has to be a car part. What is that? Is there a hunt going on? What is this? Look, I can't even get up to like 800 points or 1,000. Bruh. Is this even good for the drift track? Right, let's go uphill right here. Go hit that cone. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Okay, there we go. We hit our first 1,000 points. Good thing we're doing this by ourselves because we definitely would have lost. <laughs> here we go. Let's see if we can get 10K. Yo, there we go. Nice, bro. All right, 16K. Just like that. Not too bad. Not too bad. Okay, I would say that this is an okay drift car. I mean, it is the first prize. It is the 350Z. But let's go ahead and put the new spoiler on too. I want to see how that looks like. Here we go. Let's get the spoiler. S14. Dude, look at this. This is insane. Okay, we got to put that in the car. But now that we have this fully upgraded, let's see if it's good now at the season 14 track. I really doubt it. Here we go. Let's go ahead and race this again. You guys can see we're racing against the other cars. The same exact cars that we did, but the drifts are a lot faster, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Here we go. Big drift right here. Let's see if I can get it. Yeah, no! <laughs> I hit the wall. Uh, I mean, we could go a little bit faster, but since it's a drift car, you guys can see the wheel does not turn all the way. It's just super slow. All right, drift around here. I mean, it is pretty cool. I mean, I wish you would have done this with drift points only, but this Nissan 350Z is actually pretty cool. Look at that. Yeah, oh, I almost hit the wall. And look at that wing behind us. That is nice. All right, here we go. Third place. I don't think anybody has passed that yet. But let's see if I can just... Bruh. Oh my gosh. This thing is hard to drift. I think the thing with this season, guys, is that these cars already have body kits. I think that's the nice thing about it. And that's the only difference about it. But other than that, we just got the same cars as last time. All right. Last attempt on this drift. Yo! <laughs> Dude, that was actually pretty sick. If you guys actually get it right... And you drift around these corners. It's actually pretty smooth. Look at that. Do it again. Yeah. All right. We got to do an all drift car race on this one for the next video. Here we go. Drift again. Dude, clean drifts. I think it's because of the wing, guys. Can I drift through these? Oh, dude. Almost. I would have been sick if we did. Now, this one I kind of mastered already. No. Oh, I said that and then I crashed into the wall. The first person mode is pretty cool, guys. You guys can see it is pretty because of the race. And it just seems so much easier to drift. There we go. Last place again, and I got laughed. Look at that, 50 trophies, not bad. All right, let's see what else we can unlock. You guys can see we pretty much got our uh, thing progressed like 20%. We're not there yet, but it looks like the next car that we're unlocking, guys, is the body kit and the Nissan T33 Pro. So if you guys want that for the next video and you guys want me to review it, let me know in the comments down below. That is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. What do you guys think about this 350Z Pro? Leave it in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. And peace out.